So in step three of the audit process, if you find out that you have violations and you caught those, what do you need to do now? Well, it's pretty simple. If you find you've been negligent in paying your employees and making them whole, you need to document all of your findings and calculations very carefully. I usually like to do that in a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet. I like to document on uh, you know, any sort of documents that tell me this is what I found, this is the calculation I used, this is what I saw, you know, giving any sort of details so I understand exactly where this came from. Now, it's important that you display what they were paid and what they should have been paid. This will give you an idea of how much you owe this person in back wages. Now, this is gonna probably be the scariest part. Once you get all this proof and documentation together, the next step is contacting the Department of Labor and voluntarily reporting your findings. You might say, well, why in the heck am I going to do that? That's going to put me in a really dangerous situation. Well, by contacting the Department of Labor and letting them know what you found, you will actually not be charged liquidated damages on top of back wages owed. So I contacted the Department of Labor earlier in 2023 when I started my business and I asked the question, if an employer reaches out to you and says, we made a mistake and we need to fix it, and we need to rectify it, is that employer still charged liquidated damages? And the Department of Labor representative here in the state of Louisiana said, no, you will not be charged liquidated damages. So let me just give you an example of how huge that is. Let's say you find out that you owe $17,000 in back wages. Well, you just saved yourself an additional $17,000 in potential penalties because the Department of Labor is not going to penalize you for finding the mistake yourself. If the employee goes and reports this before you even have a chance, guess what? Those liquidated damages are all fair play.